All right, what's going on, guys? Welcome back to another Modern mm, Cube Draft. Uh, we are going to start with uh, someone who donated last night. Uh, Dummel, his his stipulation was to draft a Jun deck. Uh, last night we drafted a Jun deck, and then we couldn't help but take blue cards. I probably I couldn't help but take blue cards because there was like Nicol Bolas and Dragonlance Solemngar and Astriok and, and Scarab God, and I just wanted to play blue as well. So uh, today we're going to stick to it. We're going to do just Jun. We're going to avoid all the blue cards and the, and the white cards. And uh, we're going to try to uh, not draft any of the other colors that are oh so tempting all the time. So that's the goal. <clears throat> and we'll see. We'll see how that goes. Is watching your stream while driving to work a good idea? Yeah, I don't see why not, actually. I um, As long as you're not also chatting at the same time. I would say listening to the stream is a better idea. Yeah, I don't know about watching. I don't know if I don't know if you should keep your eyes on the stream while you're driving to work, but I mean, you can listen to it, and I think that's completely safe. It's like a podcast. I'm driving too. It's okay. Wow. So apparently, this is just the uh, apparently my stream is just a podcast that you listen to on your way to work or anywhere. The eldest reborn? No, I'm gonna look at it right now though. I don't know what it is, though. All right. Jund. Jund, Jund, Jund. Here we go. Sword of Fire and Ice is probably the best Jund card in here. <laughs> uh, Sword of Fire and Ice is pretty good. I'm pretty sure it's better than Aristocrat and Persecutor. It might be better than Shriek Maw. I think it's one. I think it's Shriekmar or, or or Sword. I think Persecutor is good, Nick. I do, but I don't like having to have an answer for a card that doesn't let me win the game. It is the cube, so there's probably going to be one. What is this? The Last Reborn. What is the? Where is the card? Also, this set looks amazing. I can't get over it. Is that what it's called? The Last Reborn. The Eternal Reborn. Reborn Eternal. Give me the, the eldest reborn. I still don't know what 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 is it? What is it? Rare? Is it a color? What are we taking here? Shriek Maw? Or I like sword. I'm taking sword. That's a that's a Jun card. <laughs> sure is. Lotus Cobra. Here we go. Alan Alan is just gonna show it. All right. Oh God! Look at this art. This is great. Each opponent sacrifices a creature or planeswalker. Each opponent discards a card. Put target creature or planeswalker card from your graveyard onto the battlefield under your control. That's pretty good. That seems okay. I like that. Vapors hope to get back Persecutor. Huh. What do you think, man? I don't even know what to take here. I like Lotus Cobra. I like Lotus Cobra, too. Oh, look at that art. Oh, that's some Nicol Bolas art. Yeah, I'm going to take a Lotus Cobra here. Very watercolory. Jester, do you like Spectre here? I don't hate Spectre, but I like having mana fixing in a three-color deck. So I'm going to go with Lotus Cobra. Hmm. Here he is again. Got to avoid it. Got to just ignore it. Mind chatter? I was liking Liliana better. Okay. Okay, I'm here to help because as a Twitch viewer that plays Magic, you are at an advantage because I can see the game. What does that mean? Look at that. Oh, the chat went crazy for Lily there. Oh, Blood Crypt. And a Sheltered Thicket. Well, dang. We could take this Nahiri, but we're Jund. We're also Jund Walkers, let's not forget. We're Walkers and removal, so we gotta take those things higher than most. Yeah, I'm gonna I think, think it's blood curb. Yeah, I think so too. Well, we don't have any removal and any Devil's play is technically removal. Yeah, but it's pretty bad. I think I'd just rather have Eternal Witness because in the late game this is just double removal, right? Sure. Although yeah. Devil's Play does have flashback. So I guess they're both double removal. Mm -hmm. <laughs> Do 
Thunderbreak is a Jun beater, but I like Eternal Witness a little bit better. Do -do 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 -do. Twilight Mire. And oh I like I actually like Draga Tree Speaker in this deck because we have two of these guys. Man, but those lands though. Tree Speaker's pretty good. Tree Speaker is pretty good. I think it's Tree Speaker. Green Soul Ring seems good, especially with Sword of Fire and Ice. Plus, I bet one of those lands comes back, to be quite honest. Mike B is particularly handsome today. Look at those cheeks. Do you have good-looking cheeks today? <laughs> oh, boy. Please don't encourage him. He's already weird enough. Oh, Raging Ravine. Look, Vance's Blasting Cannons, your favorite. Womp, womp, womp. I'm going to take this Raging Ravine. Is that good, Chandra? It's hard because I usually use cards from what they do. Uh, I didn't even see a Chandra. Was there a Chandra? Yeah. Why didn't you tell me that? I thought your eyeballs would have done that for you. What did I, <laughs> what did I take over Chandra? Uh, Blood Crypt? Oh, that was a while ago. Or maybe it was Draw Tree Speaker. You have no idea, do you? I don't know. Oh, I'm going to take the Immortal Sun, even though we just agreed that this is a Planeswalker stipulation. Dang it! <laughs> I always want to play this card, and the two times I've opened it, I was doing Planeswalker stipulations. I don't like Life Bane Zombie. I don't like Voltaic Brawler. I mean, we don't have... Well, we do have one Planeswalker, I guess. I think this is actually still fine. Just don't play it if you got Planeswalkers. What problem is? I think it's better than the other cards. Oh wow. Percy and 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 Shrieky came back. Tough call. It is tough call. Are we talking about his face cheeks? <laughs> oh god. I would take Shriek Ma. I would too. I like Shriek Ma better than Persecutor. Well, I imagine we're gonna get consuming vapors too. We can also go Shriek Maw on two, Eternal Witness on three, get back Shriek Maw. That's pretty good. Hey, that's pretty good. Did you know that was pretty good? It's all right. Did you know anything? Not really. Look, there's the Consuming Vapors and Hypnotic Spectre. What do you think? I think Consuming Vapors is a little better. I do too, actually. Plus it's removal. You're right. That is part of the stip. I think the fact that some cards have no art is legitimately a thing that hurts the drafting. Your eyes just glaze over a card. Yeah, I agree with you, actually. Oh, the Mind Shatter came back. So did Forked Bolt. I don't care about the stinking Forked Bolt. Okay, we'll Mind Shatter. I like having the Wicker Ball Elder. I think he's a good answer to things. Black is pretty open. Yeah, so is green, actually. So far, we have no red cards. Yeah, both of our lands are red-based, so. Old Fleecy. If that Siege Rhino comes back, it might just be an Abzan stream, boys. Huh. That's a that's a card. We did lose to this. Did you? Were you here yesterday when we lost to it? Oh wow! No, I'll actually play. So. Really? Mm -hmm. I'm pretty sure you were. I'm pretty sure I wasn't. Is it just Grave Titan here? See, like I didn't even look at this cough because it just had no art. Oh my god, you're right. Cough doesn't count for this kind of deck. Right, but I'm just I'm just expressing that the point is. What are we taking here? Grave Dad. Is it Grave Dad over Huntmaster? I think it is. That's a good one. This is also a good one. Yeah, Eric. 
Also, neither of those black Greenlands came back, apparently. I like Garuk. Garuk is on fire. You don't need no more to let no more to Garuk burn. I think Garrick's better since we do have a bunch of expensive stuff right now. Plus, we also want to be able to sword and equip in the same turn. Greetings, Planeswalker, and also Mike Bizen the Trap. I don't know what that means. Is that his name now? Also, what up, Jack Damage? It's got to be Doomblade, right? Straight up Doomblade. Like, we're not even red yet, so... I like a Doomblade. When are you going to go back to Twitter? I don't know. I haven't used Twitter in, like, four months. I haven't really missed it. Oh, Nick went crazy for Olivia there. Olivia might come back, though. Look with your skeleton eyes. What are foothills? Probably. Oh, it brought Creekwood Liege. What does that thing do? <laughs> exactly. It's a 2-2 two, two for 4. Other black creatures get plus 1, plus 1. Other green creatures get plus 1, plus 1. At the beginning of your upkeep, you can make a 1-1 one, one black and green worm token. It's pretty slow. You're pretty slow. Wow. What if foothills is pretty good? What if... I bet Creekwood Liege comes back. Probably. I'll take the Foothills and hope the Creekwood Leash comes back. Or the Rattleclaw Mystic. I'll even take that. Uh, okay. Uh, what are you taking here? Arc Trail? Murderous Cut? You probably like a Murderous Cut. Yeah. I think you're a big Murderous Cut, cut fan. Cut it up. Have you seen an overgrown two-man? I don't think so. Disfigure. This is a good Chandra. I also like Primal Storm a lot. Whenever it attacks, exile the top card of each player's library, then you can cast those for free without paying their mana costs. Mm -hmm. That card seems super cool. It's not a Planeswalker, though. Victim of Night is also very, very good. Mm -hmm. Someone tell me to take a Tali over Chandra. Because it's super cool. <laughs> yeah, one vote. Uh, one, two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight. No, there have to be two cards in this pack coming back. It's probably going to be like Phantasmal Bear and Grafted War Gear. I'm going to take a Tali. Bloodbraid Elf. That's literally the most gen card you can have. You're right. I like a treetop village. I like a duplicate too, surprisingly. I think it's treetop village though. Why don't the cards have art again? Um, magic online. Huntmaster came back. Wow, that's interesting. I'll take it. Also a Nissa though. I don't like that Nissa. Really? It's really unimpressive to me. That's funny, because I was asking her the other day what she thought of you, and she was like, he's really unimpressive to me. So like, I think you guys have hmm. similar feelings on on that. So you think it's Huntmaster? Mm -hmm. Alright. Mm, slaughter Pack seems fine. I'll play a Slaughter Pack. Oh, Rootbound Crag coming back is just juice. 
The reason I like Nissa better than Huntmaster is because you can hit a Nissa off a of Bloodbraid Elf, and it's also much better on the curve now because we're getting a lot of four drops here. But it also makes guys to equip his sword, so that seems fine. But, you know, what can you do? Let me check out my telephone. I'm Michael on my telephone. You don't say. What's an MB, Alan? <laughs> yes. This is a bottle full of hooch. What's a main board? You ever heard of a main board? Oh, primary deck. I got you. Understood. Which is it? I don't know what to do. I think it's Gear Hulk. Gear Hulk seems pretty good. He's pretty good. I like Arc Trail. I think Gear Hulk is always a card that crushes us when it's played against us, but it's always a card I look at and I'm like, oh, I was only half right. I like the card that they gave us, though. That's pretty good. Gear Hulk's always a card I'm like, oh, that's just a moderate. That's just a, a standard legal card that's probably not super impressive. And then it crushes us, and I'm like, oh, that's sad. Oh, that's a good sideboard card. I always appreciate the last pick relevant sideboard cards. All right, we have stuck to our Jund conditions so far oof oh I like choopy big choops I also like pulse I think pulse is probably better than choops right it's a mana cheaper and it kills planeswalkers which is extremely relevant he kills anything <laughs> even a boat Wow, it kills boats? Mm -hmm. That's violent. Bloodbird Elf into Pulse, yeah, and Dismember. Oh, Verdant Catacomb. Oh, but this guy. This pack is great, and something is going to come back, whether it's this, 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 or this. It's not going to be this. It's not going to be this either. Why do I get so irritated when people say mainboard? Because it's just not what it's called. It's just it's just not what it's called. Like, um, because I was an editor for seven years. I have an English degree. Like, I appreciate accuracy in language is really what it comes down to. And I like when things are uh, referred to correctly because it's clear communication, right? So that that is why I like things. I like it being called commander instead of uh, EDH because it's it's clarity. I like it being called Sultai instead of Bug. Is it command? Is it catacombs or a primal titan? We got nine seconds. Come on, what's it gonna be? Prime time. I I think you're right. Stomping ground. He's like a double fetch land. <laughs> two 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 fetch lands in one. Uh I think it's stomping ground 100 percent here. Yep. You appreciate Angerson Chupa Chups? I never called him Chupa Chups. I've never called him that. Uh, but Michael Barbegly Boo. It's actually Barbobly Boo. Um, and that's his real name, so I don't know what problem is. I think it's Nissa. This is a Planeswalker. Yep. Okay. I like Lanamar Waifs. Waifs. <laughs> Wastes. All our, all our fixing lands are red-green right now, so we're going to have to use a lot of Swampers. What's a Swamper? You know what a Swamper is. Tronic could probably get cut. Sword of Feast and Fame. How many Elder Dinosaurs do we get to play? <laughs> Whip seems actually pretty good with all these... Uh, Fatties. And all these Enter the Battlefield cards, like Huntmaster, Gear Hulk, Shriek Maw... Two of you said Tetsamok? Wow, that's crazy. The English major doesn't know what problem is. <laughs> I 
I did, however, dribble some drink down my down my face, so apologize for that. Why do you guys keep saying Tetsamok? We're not taking this stupid Tetsamok. I think it's Whip, right? Is it Whip? Tell me it's Whip. It's Whip. I took the Whip. Ghost okay. Ride. Ghost Ride your Whip. Nighthawk? Or Galta. Burst Light. How many times have we been wrecked by Galta? We can Many also whip time. back a Galta, gain 12 life. Oh, nice. I don't hate that. Also, that's another Elder Dinosaur, so if we took the uh, the other one... Boy, that'd be hilarious. We just have a million Galta... We just have a million Elder Dinosaurs in our deck. Is it just this guy? It's gotta be better than Burst Lightning. Is it better than Vampire Nighthawk, though? You guys are saying Galta, so we're just gonna take the Galta. I don't have the gall to... I, I don't think that's right, but we did take it. I think Nighthawk was way better. Is it Abrupt Decay? It's gotta be Abrupt Decay, right? It's also a Braid. Braid's good, too. I think Decay is a little better, though. I think we can put this in the sideboard for now. Oh, go for the throat's a gift. That is a... That is just a treat. I think I think both of these are... All our removal art now is better than... I really wanted this guy to come back, so that's pretty good. I think Disfigure can get cut. Arc Trail is worse than Doomblade and Go for the Throat and Abrupt Decay, I think. Man, none of the good ones came back. Sweltering Suns is a pretty good sideboard. I like having a Sweltering Suns. I agree with you. Still two more cuts here. I think it's... I think we can probably cut Drana. Arlen, Walker, Nissa, Jung, Jund. I have no idea what you guys are saying right now. You're basically all drunk. Like, we have to play Galta now because we've committed to it, so. I wish... Didn't we say this was a Jund... Yeah, we did. It is a Jund Walker step. But I'm not going to take a bad Jund Walker. We're not going to play Arlen Court in our deck. Lignify is decent. Lignify is not terrible. Sir Mix a lot. Wow, this is not. Oh my god. My Anaconda don't want none unless you draft my. <laughs> All right, Alan. We'll be doing that next. I love you, buddy. You are amazing. All right. Big butts next time. Sir Mix a lot stipulation. Is that like toughness or? Yeah, big. The butts are toughness, man. Okay. Also, Alan, what happens if there's... How do we take removal and stuff and Planeswalkers? You got to figure that out in a way that... Um, in a, <laughs> that's not me, but I love that person. You hear me? I love you. That's not you? There's no way that's not you. Last chance for free appetizer. Oh, my God. Oh, my God. I'm going to take this Abbot of Carol Keep, I guess? Meh. Grimmy? Meh. They're both pretty meh, you're right. None of these cards are being Someone's played. Someone's getting a real late hero blade hold, though. This guy's late. Playable. Come on. <clears throat> Alright, fourth pack. Oh, just kidding, there's no fourth pack. <laughs> JK. We only have one Planeswalker, and I think if you only have one Planeswalker, the Immortal Sun is actually very, very good. Probably. Right? We like, have, Actually, we have three. We have Nissa. Oh, we have Nissa, Liliana, Liliana, and Garrick. Yeah. Dang. What if we cut all three and then just add Immortal Sun? Hmm. You know, I don't hate that idea. But the stipulation was Walkers, so... Yeah, <clears throat> I think you're right. All right, so what do we cut? That we need two cuts. I don't. Mind Shatter keeps giving me pause. Immortal Sun is very good. The funny thing is, we could cut this, this, and this. Add Immortal Sun. And now we're just. 
Now we're just black green. I don't think I like that though. I really want to play with this guy. And I like these other red cards. And it's super easy to splash red because most of our fixing is red green. Oh, uh, I think Vapors is really good. We do have a lot of removal though. We have Doomblade, Go for the Throat, Abrupt Decay, Maelstrom Pulse, Consuming Vapors, Murderous Cut, Shriek Maw. It's good though. Having that much removal? Yeah. I think we can cut one piece of removal. We can also cut Drana, I think. Yeah, Drana's fine to cut. What's our one removal to cut here? Doomblade? It is the most narrow. Yeah. And we also have Shriek Maw's also a Doomblade. Yeah, I think this is fine. I like this. Nope, you're, you stay home. And we also have Disfigure Slaughter Pact in the sideboard, along with Arc Trail. A lot of things. Filk Money, have a good afternoon. Or night, or, you know, whatever whatever you want to do. Whatever, whatever time of the day you want to enjoy. Enjoy it. All right, um, five, six, seven, eight, nine, ten. That's probably too many. So we'll say nine. Uh, four, five, six, seven, eight. So eight, nine right now. One, two, three, four, probably one of these. If that, I'm not even sure we need one. Okay, this is one, two, three, four, five sources, plus a Lotus Cobra, which is six. Yeah, but my Primal Storm guy is double red. You're right. What is it? Six, ten, eleven. This is this should be fine. I like it. I'm in. What's not a Jun's tip? What are you saying right now? Don't need mind shatter? You always need mind shatter. Always. Always be shattering minds. I'll shatter your mind. With a hammer. Oh, mind hammer shatter. That's a classic. That's loud. It's always loud. Really? This is how you're going to be? I'm going to keep it anyway. I don't even care. Oh, no. There's a green on top. Don't you worry. Better hope there is. And Terry's 409. Thank you so much for the sub. Really appreciate it. Welcome to the Sultai Brood. So close. Ready? That's not it, but it's still a land, so I'm okay with it. This was... An aggressive keep. I don't mess around, man. Give me a green. That's another black. It's not looking good, but if we got a green, we're actually in great shape. We can play Hunt Master. And that's pretty much it. I will take a Wooded Foothills. Oh, no. Hmm. I imagine you just take two lands here. Yep. <gasps> I asked for it. I said, give me a wooded foothills. And here it is. Nope, that's not the one we want. Ugh, can we stop this somehow? Can we redirect it? Life finds a way. Explain to me what you mean by that. Just think about it. <laughs> just just think about it. Oh, they play Swamp? Alright, we know that's gone. I've been watching YouTube content for all for at least a year now. I figured it's about time to show some support. Love you both. Thanks for Thank you so much, man. Really appreciate it. That is awesome. What did you just do? Oh, they put a prey counter on both of our guys. How nice. 
Oh, this guy flipperinos. I will redirect to Jace. Oh, I got the vapors again. Well, what are the odds you can kill? With double blue? Probably not very high. Well, they also have this, which can, they can also bounce maybe. I'm going to, I'm going to cross my fingers. I think we did it. Yes. All right, cool. Ba dum 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 boom ba dum 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 da dum dum dum. I mean, our guys die, unfortunately, but what can you do? You're gonna counter this guy? Wow, that is aggressive. Super aggro. That was indeed super aggro. Yeah, but they're gonna Tetsamok and we can consume we can vapor them. Vape life. Look how fast they're gonna play that. Oh, I can't play this card any faster. You got it. Vape Nace, y'all. What's a good quality of the cube of this cube that Legacy or Vintage Cube doesn't have for science? We all know this. Um that's a good question. <laughs> oh, oh no. boy. Here we go again. Maybe we won't pay for the pack. Okay, you did. Amazing. I am amazed. Okay, it's getting it's getting real old. Like these like mono counter spell decks are getting super obnoxious. I don't even think we have anything great to board in here. Um, not really. I mean, our hand was pretty slow, to be fair, but nonetheless, like, I still would rather have, uh, I'd rather have, like, at least, you know, two of my spells resolve, so. There you go, another Ancestral Vision turn. Yep, every game. All right. Good times. Land one time. That's a good one. Yes. Got a black. So next time we could play Gear Hulk if they tap out for something stupid. That could be good. I think the plan should also be having a play before turn five. Solid, solid suggestion. I, uh, I can support that. I mean, I have to assume Shriekma has some targets. Like, just because they only played a six mana Elder Dinosaur, I have to assume they do have blue creatures in their deck, so I don't think this is terrible. Interesting choice. Well. 
Archer, thank you so much. Really appreciate it. Welcome to the Salt High Bird. So close. So close. I'm going to get to draw an extra three cards next turn. <laughs> I think it's supposed to say Bug Brood. Wow. Rude. Super rude. Oh, they've just put a prey counter. Because that's what like you do. Now, at least we can get a Blood Crypt here, which is pretty good. I feel like just activating this is pretty good. But, one, two, three, four, five... Yeah, I don't want them to actually be able to play anything here, so. I'm afraid if we play Gear Hulk, they're just going to counter it. Then they're going to play Tetsamok. Mike never did show his belly, which is pretty rude if you ask me, but. I can't get my mom to buy me tendies. She won't give me chores to get good boy points. Just complains that I'm 42 and need to move out of the house. What do I do? Hmm. Well, I don't know. It's tough when you can't get those can't get those tendies. I'll be honest with you. What do we do? Do we vapors here or do we urtai, urtai, itali? Blah, 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 blah. Probably vapors. Probably vapors. Let's see if you got the pact again. Oh, waiting to sacrifice. Oh, that was good. I enjoyed that. Can't decide if I want Jiggle Belly from Akutinaga Forest or the Shuffle Shuffle. Is this? Are we talking about a tattoo, or is this just a gen in general? You can't decide which one you like more. You get to choose nothing. Sweet Peak. That doesn't let you draw a card, my friend. I like a good Sweet Peak. I like a good sweet peak. I bet you do, pervert. All right, I'll rebound. I choose you. Nothing happened. I'm just going to make you use up your counter spells. More like counter smells, am I right? I don't think so. What is this? What are you paying 16 mana for? <laughs> sure. I do it for four. I only have two mana. I don't know how magic works. It's confusing. We could have had Simeon's Spirit Guide in our hand, I guess. <laughs> That'd still only be three. Right, so they had to do it for four, right? Oh, I, I guess they had the soul read on the, <laughs> the Simon Spirit Guide. <laughs> oh, oh, here he is. It's your boy. Hope you don't have a removal spell. Attack it, I guess. Oh, two, two Planeswalkers in one turn. That's not a guy yet. So you'd be a 5-5. Five, five. Alright. Do your worst, I guess. Which probably includes killing my dinosaur. But, you know, whatever. Which member? Oh, this member. Oh, you had a removal spell already. Seems good. Congratulations. Is 
This is all very interesting. So I got two cards. One is a dismember. Okay. Okay. How you doing with that mic stand? You crossing it? Just fine. Okay. Are they going to make a zombie? Exile one of my guys and make a zombie? Sure they are. So one, two, three, four, five. Shriek my one, murderous cut the other. Virgilus Gear Hulk next turn seems pretty good. Mike seems to treat the world around him like a pillow. <laughs> Here we go. Here we go. Pillow for your thoughts. One, two, three, four. Activate. And we can actually shriek maw this guy. Does this guy have trample? Mm -mm. That's unfortunate. Oh, you do have dismember too. Let's not forget about that. Can I get my dude back? Dude back. And that's the end. Galta does cost nine right now, which is a pretty good value. Mike B, I'm shaving my beard tomorrow. When are you shaving your Chia Pet? Every day. I shave my Chia Pet every day. Can you prove that? Mm-hmm. This is a fun game we're playing. I disagree. Oh, right. What was I thinking? Oh, right. I was thinking about a different game. Uh, what goes in the hand? Mana Leak and Tassiger. Leak, Tassiger. Okay, sure. Probably wouldn't for the Tamiyo myself, but, you know. What do I know? So you have three of the four cards in your hand? Okay. They're all pretty good. They're not bad. Well, that's pretty good. I guess we can Marcus cut now. Yeah, they just mana it, right? Oh, yeah, true. Still going to do it. One, two, three. Sure. At least that way it gets a card out of the hand instead of the Glenelinger Archmage. And your last card is this Dismember. Three, four, six, seven. Did I tap incorrectly? Four, five, six, seven, eight, nine, ten, eleven. Because they can kill one, so I don't think it matters. We're not going to be playing this guy this turn. They're going to dismember something here. I'd be shocked if they didn't. And Galta's going to cost like eight. So. Well, we definitely tapped incorrectly now. Now I feel silly because I did not expect that to resolve. Wow, that was a huge mistake now. 
Wow, they just traded a Tassiger for that? I did not expect Gear Hulk or the other guy to resolve with the counters. That was a huge surprise to me. Why wouldn't you dismember something? Wow, I'm... Wow. That was my own fault. I can't even blame anybody but myself for that one, but still. So, dismember in one other card. BB. So, this would be six, seven, eight, nine, which leaves you costing three, five, right? One, two, three, four, five. So, we're one mana shy if we actually play Bloodbraid Elf, but depending on what we hit. Go for the throat on zombie, I guess. Sure. Six, seven, eight, nine. No, actually, this is only three mana. <laughs> All right, that's pretty good. Let's do that. I did math wrong. <sighs> yep. Can you open a GoFundMe for Mike? I think he needs an old rocking chair and a corncob pipe whenever he's on stream. I, I think that's pretty reasonable. I would do that. You would do what? Corncob pipe. You would do corncob pipe? Mm hmm. That was a great disallow. I'm really glad our opponent was able to nab the counter spell that was good enough in that situation. I wasn't a fan. Oh, right. Me neither. That's what I meant. And we missed the one opportunity to do it previously, so that's unfortunate. Master Pulse one time. Draga Tree Speaker. Ha <laughs> ha. We're all going to Ashiok. Don't care. Can you put weed in a corn cob pipe? I think that's the only way Mike would be sold. Wow. Mike doesn't even smoke. Psh. That's what you think. It That's correct. That is what I think. How many marijuana cigarettes fit in a corn cob pipe? That's a good question. Two. The surprise of no one. Yeah, we're just going to go to the next game. I don't feel like dealing with this. Like, they're just going to... So, what does that get back? Anything? They're going to have uh, Grave Titan, so... Like, I guess we can go for the throat the Grave Titan while they still have two Planeswalkers on board. Yeah, not, not really ideal. No, that was fun. I can confirm the corn cob pipe with weed works. Wow. 
I don't know how this these chats get into into weed chats. I have no idea how this happens. I guess it's because you're marijuana cigarettes. I wonder if we like. I wonder if that game just is a totally different game. If we actually, if we're able to cast uh, Galta when we when we should have been able to cast Galta, although I didn't ever expect them to misplay and allow it to resolve. So very strange. Oh, we got a soul ring here, so that's pretty good. Doom 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 doom. Guess we'll attack. Do we fear the condemn? Also gonna chase these three weeds a day, you ourselves a magic player. I don't even know what's going on right now. I inject six weeds a day. Okay, let's slow down. You don't need the FBI to come over here and, and confiscate your weeds that you inject every day. It's for my glaucoma. It's for his medical condition. <laughs> oh, boy, oh, boy. Micaeus? When you're with your breeding pool planes, your breeding pool forest deck? I'm intrigued. We have nothing to do, so we level up. Those who can't, level up. Oh, this is the FBI. I'm here for all your weeds. <laughs> <laughs> oh, my God. Are you just Micaeus for two here? What happens here, I wonder? Okay, well, we're having a good time. Welcome to Dirt Burger USA. Population, Plunker mage. my opponent. Broken... Make him sack it. Seems boring. Boring! That means they just don't play anything next turn. I think I'd rather just have them play something next turn. Kapow. Get Recky Rude. No one says that. You just did, though. Yeah, you're right. Pretty sure the ATF is in charge of injecting weed since it's a firearm. Wow, that's weird. I didn't even know that. Yeah, you might if you're if you're doing six weeds a day, you probably want to cut back on the the weeds. Pride mage. Unless you get rid of them. Yep, didn't think so. Bant Charm. Which is great because we're going to play this guy, so... I just really want to attack with this guy and get some cool abilities, but... All right. Good luck. Yeah, I'll need it. I almost think during upkeep we actually abrupt decay this guy so that they have to sacrifice the oracle. <sighs> Duty snatches. Thank you so much for the sub. Welcome to the Sultai Brew. Really appreciate it. You are awesome. Okay, why would it go under this so I can't see it? I don't I don't understand. Don't swerve me, bro. 
Ain't nobody got swerve. Hmm. Well, I'm not thrilled with this hand, especially when this guy is just going to die, but... You don't know that. Duty Snatches, you are awesome. If if there's no... If for no other reason than that amazing name, Duty Snatches. Can you regale us with the story of how you come up with the name Duty Snatches? Because I'm always curious about people's names. Like, you're like, I need to make a username for Twitch or whatever. You know, whatever you use it for. And you're like, let's see if Duty Snatches is taken. And I want to know how that happens. That seems like a good story. Oh. What? 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 Did hmm. that really just happen? Boy, I don't I didn't see what happened. They just band charmed our Draga tree speaker. Oh wow. Oh, I guess we just win. How often do you dye your beard? Who? Who are you talking to? My beard is like mostly white. How you think I dye my mostly white beard? <laughs> like, where does the dye go? <laughs> like, does it just disappear? You're supposed to say you dye it white, so they'll think you're younger. Yeah, that's wait. Oh, so they think I'm younger, but then they but like I'm faking it? Yeah. Yeah, all right, that's weird. I don't know why you'd think that, but okay. Honestly, it's not even a good story. Way back in the day when I was in middle school, I just came up with the term, and it's been my gaming name ever since. And I'm 28 now, if that speaks to my maturity level. um, Yeah, I think that's perfect, though. That's I think that's a totally generational thing for us, right? Like, Yeah, I just can't exile anything with this dinosaur, unfortunately. I'm still dreaming. Do I bring anything in here? Mm-mm. My eight month old my eight month old son is super interested in your stream right now. Can you please say Harbor, hi buddy? Let me take a mind chatter for like a more another removal spell. I could Doom Blade. His light beard hairs are actually this the, this filaments of pure silver that grow straight out of his jawbone. Yeah, I don't like talking about my pure silver filaments because then people try to uh Steal my, well, filaments in the night, so it's real awkward. Filament in the night. Yeah, I don't want to talk about it. I don't know why you keep bringing it up. It's hurt my feelings. Filaments in the night, exchanging glances. Filaments in the night. Gerard Tree Speaker. Dang it. Can't get, can't get that lucky twice. Lightning doesn't strike twice. Harper, make sure your first words aren't duty snatches, buddy. No duty snatches. No do snatches. What up, Zaxor? Zaxor, it's it's modern cube time, buddy. You know what that means. And then we killed this oracle of Smoldaya. All right, Micaiah's on top. You guys are great. He's super... <laughs> Harper, glad I could help, buddy. Your dad's a cool dude. Don't forget it. Zaxor, what was the stip you recommended? You got to refresh me. It's been a while. I guess I could check Twitch, but, you know, I'm streaming here. So, you know, you know what it's like. I've really just been waiting for Mike to take over the stream. I have multiple friends in the back so he can be Dirty Mike and the boys. Wow. I don't have any friends. Hey, don't say that, okay? 
You have plenty of friends, Dirty Mike. Oh, you mean the boys? Yeah. You know the boys. We can't even attack because then you just block with the copter. Oh, that's fine. If you took over the stream, would you bring a host of singing animal friends? Who do you think the boys are? It's <laughs> a good point. I hadn't considered that. I want to see Liliana waving a sword of fire and ice. That seems like what I want. What I want to. What I want life to be like. Oh my god! Killing the opponent without delivering a blow through attacking. Oh my god. You're a monster. You're history's greatest monster, buddy. How do you feel? You you up for it? And no attack ship? No, so, okay, you have to actually get them to a point... They, you have to get them to concede without delivering the final blow yourself. Oh, Seems this difficult. Is, I agree with you. So basically you just jam counter spells until your opponent concedes. Hmm. Sack to 3-3. Intriguing. I have a feeling we're just going to be killing a noble hierarch here. So the only card in their hand is Micaeus. They discarded a Baneslayer Angel. Yep. Well, that's pretty okay. Yeah, no attacks tips. This really isn't the, the cube for it. Well, the thing is, like, okay, Luis's favorite stip is no attacks, but it actually turns out okay most of the time. I think the reason for that is there's alternate win conditions and other things and other cubes. Um... I think the problem with Modern Cube is that you are attacking a lot. Polucranos. Okay. There's no, like, mill or storm in this cube. <clears throat> I'm scared for the most. Wow, we're drawing really well today. One, two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight. No, there's no storm. You think all Watsy wants in modern is creatures slamming into each other? That seems insane. Like, what 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 evidence bears that out at all? Storm decks? Like, um I mean like, there's maybe, like, three creature-based decks that are really, really good. Like, humans. Affinity's not even that played anymore. Turns is a great deck that's, like, making a resurgence. There's ra there's eight rack. There's, like, tons of modern decks that, like... I was thinking that the final blow would fill the stip. You can still attack them down to one life or so. And then you just have to hope they concede, I guess. Um, one, two, three, four, five, six. Rashmi's really obnoxious. I don't think Watts even has any say over modern, over the modern format. Like, like they don't actually have any kind of... They don't change it. They don't fix it. Like, they just unban Jace the Mind Sculptor. That just seems like a weird thing that people like to say without any actual evidence bearing it out. My dog likes chewing ice, too. Just so you know. Your dog? I don't know anymore. I guess we could actually having burn spells in your deck is a good way to do it. I play a three color deck in the finishing blow can't be the same color each game. Oh my god. Non-land. Wasn't a non-land, just to be just to be clear. It was a fetch land. Correct.
They didn't put a counter on their Micaeus? What's going on right now? Isn't that the second turn they didn't put a counter on it? Maybe the first turn. I don't know. Three, four, five, six, seven, eight. So we can deal four damage with our Pelucanos. Did they miscount? Pretty sure they miscounted. Unless they're playing something completely different. Yeah. <laughs> no. All right. Three. Sure. Not the same as five. All right, you deal three, it deals five, it deals four back to you, and we gain four life. Sounds good. Oh, the cover of the monitor area with the picks go, and, and, the, and the, the alternate drafting is great. Really? I just get to trade with your Pelucranus? Oh, I guess you can put a counter on in response, so that's pretty bad. And you can also sack selfless spirits, so none of these are very good. That's not terrible. Sure. Get to eat this guy? This is weird. All right, one time removal spell. It's kind of like a removal spell, actually. Kind of. <clears throat> I mean, it lets us get back, go for the throat. It lets us get back a gopher. Yes. Play land, right? Um, we can also equip here, but then Liliana dies, so let's not do that. Have you ever thought of charging a 21st step where a subscriber tells you what to pick via Discord? Could be fun. Um, How would they... How do they keep... Wow, we just... I don't even know how we won this match. Like, it doesn't even seem like we're that great of shape. They have an 8-8. No, I don't know why we won this match. I don't know either. what happened there. Um, okay, so if you guys can explain that a little better, that actually sounds great. How do you keep in contact with the person? How do they pick? Because there's a delay, you know, the stream delay. So I want to make sure they have enough time to pick. This hand seems good. I'll keep it. He charges people to pick stipulations? What does that mean? I do the same thing. Like, I have stips in my in my Twitch account. Uh, my delay is at minimum. Uh, the delay is zero for me. But it's still, like, it's still, it's, it still takes time for you to see what I'm saying, right? Like, that's just how it goes. Is it like 30 seconds or something like that? I don't think it... No, wait. It's never that long. It's like six seconds. That's pretty good. Hey, that's pretty good. Hey, that's 
it's pretty good. That, hey, that's pretty sad. There's no hey, that's pretty sad button. There's none. Dang it. Dang it! My name is Michael. You can you share my PC in view only mode? Yeah, I mean, I could definitely share the screen. Does he have any input? Like, does he say, like, hey, you can... At the beginning of your upkeep, you lose two life. Okay. Okay. Yes, black. Black, 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 number one. My only concern would be considering like Discord is open, uh, browser is open, I have a chat client open, I have Magic Online open, I have OBS open. So I just want to, I want to have something that's minimal because sharing the screen is actually Pretty mana intense, ma ma mm, resource intensive is what we're going for here. Do you kill Liliana in response here? Don't they always? I'll just play that, I guess. Grave Titan. Can you dig my grave? Yeah, we can definitely try it out. I like the idea. Oh, there's the liege. That's old creaky. Actually, how much does golf cost here? Like two? <laughs> yeah, two mana. Okay. That's pretty crazy. It might just be sword on one of these guys to trade with something. Why trade? You can play Big Dumb Dino if you don't. Um, I'm not trading the Grave Titan or thing. I'm just going to trade one of these guys, which we still have 10. I mean, I'd like to get Sword Online, though, because then it just eats a guy every turn, or we get to draw a card. And if we draw the card we draw is a land, a green land, we get to play Galta anyway. But the problem is, like, once as long as he has this Death Touch guy on the board, um, we're going to have to get through it. Galta doesn't do anything against the Death Touch guy. So I'd rather start getting these guys in there and trading with like his big dumb idiots because you're not going to trade with this guy you're going to trade with one of these two sure have you seen the movie Frank it's pretty great Michael Fassbender wears a fake head what that sounds amazing I would really like something to kill this guy. I'll be honest with you. Because now they can just block with their worms. They have one card in hand, though. All right. Feeling okay about that. Also, Galta with Sword on is pretty, 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 pretty. Pretty, 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 pretty good. <laughs> oh, you like a swordy Galta. Now we are actually going to attack with the Grave Titan. Because if you want to block here, that's totally fine. Because uh, then Galta's real good. I assume you're going to go here, here. Yep. All right. Oh, big Chupa Chups. How convenient. Well, so long. Removal spell. 
Not exactly a removal spell. It's also not that bad. It has trample himself, so. Ba bom 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 Put one on you. One on you. Two on you. Yeah, that seems good. Cause now all these dinosaurs can trade all these zombies can trade with all their idiots, so. And this guy, you got a double block if you want to. Oh, you do. He doesn't have trample. That's weird. And I was clearly going to re-equip next turn anyway, so I don't even know what that's about. Did I just say, did I call him Chupa Chups? Did I say that? I don't know why I would call him that. That's so weird. Glad we don't have Doomblade in here. I guess we can also cut Shriekma on the mono black deck. Yes. This figure seems better, though. Yes. My name is Michael. Yes. Uh, it's pronounced Michael. <laughs> <laughs> oh, good old Michael. Your favorite and mine. So close, dude. Oh, I like this hand. I like this hand. I like it a lot. It's from... I feel like that. maybe that should be on here. Jim Carrey. You guys remember Jim Carrey? He was in uh, Ace Ventura. Pet detective. Remember that time your mom was a pet detective? No. You will. Will I? In the future. Hmm. I'm not so sure. Think about it. Birthing Pot is never getting unbanned. Stop it. Just stop it. Don't be like this. That was a good land to draw. Lotus Cobra never survives. Ready? And dead. And not dead. Oh, still dead. Okay. Unban Ayavugan first. I feel like my chat is literally just a bunch of degenerates trying to talk about cards in modern that have no business being unbanned. You people are all savages. What's wrong with Ayavugan? Really? Really? Mm hmm? Really? I took my go for the throat. That's, that's the rudest thing you could have done. Whatever, I got a... Blood Braid with your name on it, buddy. You know what I hate? That you can't cascade when you whip a Veribus Blood Braid Elf. Here comes the Frixian Obliterator. too bad. You ready? No, you did say it, and it happened. So, there's only really yourself to blame. I feel like I'm a mutant. I have mutant powers. I don't know. I guess we're hoping for uh, Maelstrom Pulse or Go for the Throat or... Oh, they have the Go for the Throat, so Maelstrom Pulse. Eternal Witness. It's not great. I guess we can double block the Obliterator. Yay. It's pretty bad, right? It's real bad. We lose the game. Yeah, we lose the game. Like, both our creatures die, and we have to sack five permanents. Oh, of course. Casual Gary. <laughs> right, I think we're dead. Ay, 
Ay, ay, ay. Well, we're actually not dead yet. Oh, I thought you were going to play Whip. No, we can play Whip next turn. And then gain a bunch of life. Here comes the mono black. Oh, Creekwood lesions. Well, I guess we take six and go to one, but I can kill everything else. Oh, that you remember. There's no way you attack with brain maggot. Oh, Gary? No, I didn't think so. Oh, Gary? Wow, this is a bold Gary attack here. Hmm. And if they have this figure as one of their last two cards. Nope. All right, cool. Wow, they just killed a 3-2 instead of a 3-3. Three, three. Seems good. We might even be able to whip a this Bloodbird Elf back. Or... I do anything. Pretty sure we have to whip here and then attack for a bunch. One, two, three, four, five, six. We have eight mana total, so we can actually whip play Nissa. If we had ten mana, we'd be. Oh, actually, wait, we don't want one more. One, two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight. We have nine mana. Still doesn't do it. Close, but not close enough. How, why does Mike look so excited? This is just his default mode. Hooray! Three, four, five, six, seven. This seems pretty good. Here comes Mike B in black. How are we doing on the Cobra Commander meme? Not good yet. I thought about it this morning and I couldn't think of anything. But I, I didn't give it a ton of thought, admittedly, so. Just making sure we can't play that. I knew we couldn't, but I just want to make sure. Alright, that guy can't attack. So we're going to take six and go to two, but we can block the other two guys. Don't draw removal. Actually, we... Even if they have a remove, I believe that is lethal. Oh, well, maybe not, because we gain life here. Yeah, we're not dead yet, actually, because we block here. They're not going to attack with Creekwood Liege, like literal no way. They're not going to attack with Brain Maggot either, else otherwise we get rid of their Obliterator. So they actually don't have any prof prof profitable attacks here. I thought they were just going to get back Gary and kill us. They said it's opponent's graveyard. Oh. Oh my god, that'd be insane. 1, 2, 3, 4, 5, 6, 7, 8, 9, 10, 11, 12. 12, yeah. Because the only attack they have is with Obliterator, but then we get to... Oh my god, this is such a crazy attack. So we take 10, but then we gain 5. So we go to 3... And we gotta go for the throwback. Yeah, I think this game's over now. 
Yeah, that was a weird attack. And we get to return Nissa with whip and then flip her. Seems really good. So what do we have? I've got a black here. So we have one, two, three, four, five, six. We can play in a Grave Titan, but I think we'd just rather. It's actually pretty good, gains us some life. What's going on? Red, green, one, Huntmaster. Untap these two. Mr. Grumps, twelve forty two. Thank you so much for the sub. Really appreciate it. Welcome to the Sultai Brood. So we're just gonna attack with the guys. We don't care if they get back. We don't want them to get back Eternal Witness. So we're not gonna attack with that. So long, Nissa the Vastwood Seer. You are no longer alive. <laughs> that, Mr. Grumps, you were the 200th sub. Thank you so much, man. That is awesome, dude. That is super exciting. That is the most subs I've ever had. Whoop, whoop. A milestone today. Whip is putting in work. 13 to 12 now. The life gain is no joke. Well, forgot lifelink was a thing. <laughs> oh, I hate it when I can't say good games. Either way, thank you so much for watching. Really appreciate it. Dimo, I hope this was a good enough sip for you guy for you, buddy. Um There wasn't a ton of walkers, but the walkers did did a lot of work in that last game, especially Nissa and Garrick, so hopefully that was cool. Jun did end this go end up going a two for one, two one for us. Thank you so much, dude. Really appreciate it. And uh, if you guys like the content, slam those like and subscribe buttons. I'll see you next time. I always, I always look over at this guy to make sure he's not being a super weirdo, but there you go. There you go.